Video distribution is another solution that we install on most of our projects. A video matrix is a device that would sit in your equipment rack and distribute video to your TVs around the home. So for example, a four x four matrix would mean that four sources in your rack, for example, skyboxes, DVD players, Apple TV, are distributed to up to four TVs in the home. You can get an eight x eight video matrix and many other combinations are available. We would work with you during the design to establish exactly what combination you would require. Having a video distribution system installed means you can get rid of the three or four remotes that you currently use and just have one simple to use remote per TV. So as you can see, the remote says that I'm in the living room and Apple TV is selected as my source. This remote then becomes the Apple TV remote and I can navigate through Apple TV as you would expect to be able to with an Apple TV remote. Then if I want to change what I'm watching, I can simply go back and select another source, Sky for example. This remote would then become the Sky remote. So if I press guide, it would go to the guide and I can then navigate through this as you would expect to be able to using a Sky remote. The volume controls either control the TV volume or the surround sound system in the room. You don't have to do anything extra, it all just automatically works. You could then pause what you're watching in the living room and wander into the kitchen to make a sandwich with the same remote and change rooms like this. So I take my remote from the living room into the kitchen and I want to change rooms first on the remote and then I want to watch Apple TV in here. So I select the source and it changes as you would expect. I can then navigate through Apple TV and choose what I want to watch in there. Then when I'm finished in the kitchen and I want to switch the TV off, I simply select room off and turn off the kitchen TV. Then I can change rooms as I go back into the living room, perhaps with my sandwich, and uh, I can continue watching the TV in there by changing rooms again and selecting what it is I want to watch on the guide. Then again, once you're done, you can room off in there as well. The whole thing turns off, the surround sound system powers down and the system goes into standby. You can also use touchscreens and the Control 4 app to do the same thing. For example, selecting Sky icon on the touchscreen will select Sky in the living room here, and this then becomes your Sky remote. However, we would always advise to have a remote in a room where you have a TV, because without looking, you can easily change volume and channels, whereas that's a little bit harder to do on a touchscreen. So having a video distribution system installed alongside a home automation system means you can also have that integration with other products. For example, a lighting keypad could have a button that selects your favorite video source or even your favorite Sky channel. The TVs can also then become part of the occupancy, which we mentioned earlier, for security reasons, where your TVs could come on and off when you're away, giving the impression that somebody's home. This is all possible when your TVs are included as part of your home automation system.